Hi everyone, we're going to do a racetrack design number one problem. Uh, the next one we do is very similar to this one. They're about the same. So we have a racetrack in the shape of an ellipse. We, I'm putting the 100 feet long. So this whole thing is 100 feet. That means this is 50 and this is 50. And it's 50 feet wide. So this is uh, half of this is 25. And uh, you can read the 50 there. We'll take that off. And this is 25. All right. So what they want is the width 10 feet from the vertex. So if this whole length is 50, then this point here, and let's just say it's um, positive because I don't want to deal with the negative. But let's just, so this is going to be uh, 40 because I'm going to subtract 50 minus 10. That's going to be 40. Okay. And then we're going to have to find the Y. So if I, this is really negative 40, but I could have easily put it on this side. That's what I should have done. But anyway, so first of all, we're going to write the equation. So it's very easy to write. We're going to have uh, X squared over your A. Your A is half of the 100, which is 50 squared, plus Y squared over half of your B part, which is 25 squared, equals 1. All right, so there's your equation. You can simplify it if you want, but I'm going to leave it like that. Now, to find the Y, we have an X here at 40, because we're, we're moving down here to 40, and we need to find the height here. So basically, I'm going to plug in X, and uh, see if I can do it here. Mm, I'll just start it up here. So you get 40 squared over 50 squared equals y squared. No, that doesn't equal. It's plus y squared over 25 squared. We did this a lot with the bridges. Equals 1. So to solve for y, I'm going to do y squared over 25 squared equals 1 minus 1,600 over 2,500. So this whole thing, it's just going to be, um, if you reduce this, that's going to equal 9 over 25. So you get uh, y squared equals, this is 625. We'll cross multiply, you get 625 times 9 over 25. And so when you multiply that out or... Um, just square root both sides, you get y equals 15, and that's in feet. And so that's what the width is here from the vertex. So from the vertex, it's 15 feet. Okay? That's all. Thank you, and have a nice day. Bye-bye. Actually, the 15 is the whole thing. Anyway, take care. We're going to do one more. Very similar. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.